What is up YouTube, it's a boy smacking pie here. So Reanimal is now currently the talk of the town recently, ever since the announcement trailer from the Gamescom. And we're gonna talk about the comparison that both Little Nightmares 3 and Reanimal has been getting, and it's getting a little out of hand in some other video. But I will acknowledge it here that after seeing the pre-alpha gameplay and after, you know, putting the two things aside, even I said this in my last video as well, that it is crazy. It is crazy how ridiculously similar in terms of the concept both the reanimal and the freaking little nightmares 3 i mean the co-op gameplay that just the you know tip of the iceberg but this video is all about reanimal and reanimal got a new gameplay footage from the youtubers pc games i believe they're german -ish? you know link will be in the description if you want to check out their stuff if you understand that language and basically they talked about it in details we are only specifically focusing on the pre-alpha footage that they showed on their channel again credit to them link will be in the description i want to talk about what we see on our footage screen gameplay here okay so first things first insane okay even if it's just you know pre-alpha rough animation compare this with whatever we got from little nightmares 3 gameplay again not putting hate on anything or you know even though i am doing that but it is insane and it makes sense too i've said this in my previous video that tars your studios this is tars your studios right whatever they have learned it is just improving upon it 10 times 10 times bro the camera work specifically i want to shout out the camera work here the monster design right and the way the gameplay is just complementing the environment and the story that they're trying to tell here i'm not talking about the story narratively i'm talking about the story that the gameplay is trying to tell of the two kids desperately scared and running away from this monster and the camera pans the way it does even though it is co-op gameplay it still doesn't lose its scare so here we're seeing a new monster we just got into this area and this monster is amazing once again if you've seen the other monsters from the trailers it just showcases the if this was little nightmares 3 it would have put it into a different trajectory altogether but I'm glad it is a different thing, it's, it's a different thing on its own because this looks more mature, it looks more disturbing, it looks more out there, right? And while it's keeping the core of what made and what makes Little Nightmares so, you know, popular, so amazing and for so many fans to enjoy, it develops on it. They also showed the co-op gameplay in action where one character was trying to pick up the key, that kid came to life and the other person, if you're playing the co-op, would of course have to jump over to help them. If you're playing solo, the AI would do that on its own. The action is like increased 10 times, right? But the exploration and the environments are, they look just so different yet familiar, right? It has that familiarity of Little Nightmares, but it, they just look different and just feels different. Okay, the vibe is there, but when you play it, you feel like there's just an elevation from what we're used to. And it feels like it's something unique, but keeping the same formula. I'm struggling to put into words what i'm trying to say here but yes bro we're here for it with that being said we'll make some theory videos on it i just want to get this video to see if y'all are interested in reanimal videos on this channel if so let me know in the comments below and there's also little nightmares three videos coming your way as well so make sure you subscribe notifications on 100k let's go with